Fala galera, beleza? Sejam bem-vindos a mais um vídeo. E no vídeo de hoje é os highlights, são os melhores momentos das partidas profissionais de CS. Caso você curte esse quadro aqui no canal, não se esquece, se inscreve aqui no canal, sua inscrição é muito importante para a evolução do mesmo aqui na plataforma. Seu like mostra para o YouTube que você curte demais esse estilo de conteúdo, fechou? Deixa de enrolação e vamos para o que importa, são os melhores momentos. Bora lá. Like a perfect bait and switch with lots of the Dulies up close in the half wall. They were trying to lure the T's into that position to allow those Dulies to ring off. It never happens, but instead Art able to pick up the initial frag. So first blood drawn with the Glock from range at Banana, and they're gonna keep the pressure on. Lux has the potential to pop off here. Snow has done his job, but that was a beautiful flash to allow Che to come in, even the odds, and Che takes it even that step further. And finally, we have someone taking advantage in the round. Yep, and they are just gonna get right into that V-bomb site. Can't see a world, really, where they're able to come back into this one. That might just help. There's one more player here, though, and Nyx puts him down immediately. They know NQZ was in CT spawn, and he, being the... Still try to cross on the side here, but they're trying to go dry at first. They're trying to maybe temper the read of the opposition. Oh, my God. No, Kawas gets the perfect timing on that peak, and that's probably the round. The hero rifle has indeed lived up to the name. They had Gamble stacked everyone towards A and just left Kawas in CT spawn. And I'm thinking, then what is the point of this? He just has a FAMAS, he has no util. How is he going to hold B? Well, that is how. Peeks around the corner and CT sprays him down. And now it's the 1v5 for Zevi. He gets the first, but it's not going to matter. Four pistols running towards him with no armor, not even able to get a bullet off. Changing the pace, going for a faster mid play this time around. And now Snow tries to take up residence at Closet. Oh it's pushed out by Molly, but still gets two kills. With some assistance from his teammate, of course, and because it's art, they do it anyways. Holding for the boost, and JG just loses his life immediately. Now, I will say, in these South American teams, in these games, maybe I don't know if it's in the South American FPL or whatever it is, but everyone is constantly at Banana. Just the impact he could have could be huge. He's gonna get, oh, two. I thought for a moment he had botched it, but he, he got, he recovers, and that's it. And just didn't really? get spotted by the alt mid player, yeah. Oh my god. He went all the way through apps and he crossed the bridge and ran all the way around. That is yep, just... and then they're gonna buy two Mac 10s next round while the other three have AKs and yeah, that's just it's just an and art. The cycle scene. continues. Yes. And they're all circle of up life here in the smoke. The snow is waiting on the other side of it. Quick flick from Che very quickly answers back onto snow as they're coming around the corner but would you look at that cow is only able to get one quite yet they're starting to run out of time to do it and that should end it and so nqz's got to consider making sure they can't get his op somehow because they have way too much money are they gonna go for it yeah but uh, sort of unlucky for snow he realistically he probably could have um probably could have had two or three been... there yeah, that's, like, that's actually the third time in the eight rounds we've watched that he's just gotten caught immediately like that. Yeah, Luckily, I mean, you know, able to respond. Yeah, he's sticking to the game plan at the very least. You can't doubt that, as they know that Art can be here. So NQZ, Art did that yesterday where he had just... These are trying to reel this round back in. They had an early fatality, but they have recovered nicely. As it's just Nyx left, and he's stuck in the apartments behind the smoke with really no way forward. He does find the headshot in the biggest era that will allow him to get a bomb plant. As NQZ will wait for Lux so they can retake this together. Sees the shadow. And that is going to be the off shot landed. Nyx gets taken down. Ushes. So here they go. They decide not to go for the aggression right away. But they do it in the mid round. And that is a quick flick from Lux. Not able to find the second though. As Zevi runs through the smoke. He's out of bullets. But he's low HP. And the nade from Big Uzera saves his teammate. Luke Cozy trying to be the one sneaking out apartments this time, but NQZ says, I won't be having any of that. That's like on the scoreboard. Like the game reads probably close. And, you know, maybe they thought there were some weaknesses they could take advantage of. As again, the battle for Banana will never subside. It will never slow down. Even with just two players, they will fully run it straight down. And they are going to have to do it, but with this crossfire, smoke out in halls, they come right through. NQZ drops, but it is snow for two from the site. Do they know that Big Uzera is in the pit? They don't, and the crossfire is perfect. The gamble stack. Molly's clearing the corners, and here comes the push. Oh, yeah, and it's right in, Lux. Jumping around the corner, they, and he, oh, he wants to go right through the smoke. He wants to hunt Art down. No escape for you. His heart, uh, Art gets hunted, but Che, with a big double kill from backside, still just keeping that the hopes alive here for Fluxo. 
as they want to be coming up banana here no kit in play they do have a smoke and a flash though so smoke on the bomb can make a pretty big difference oh but they don't use it there they throw it towards the back hall and lux inside of the smoke this crossfire back site i mean this is going to be so hard for pain i mean not for pain for flux so they're going to have to hit all their shots but Cowes gets a double and now they're running towards the back of the site, but NQZ and Dust, like you said. Too, because again, he was on the side where the op doesn't really have a whole lot of prevalence, and now he yeah. may never even get a chance to op this half. So, like, they do have the firepower advantage with Mac 10s being toted by a couple of Ts here, but it doesn't really matter when Lux is doing things like that. And the bomb is going down, and good luck be taking this. Probably not even going to try. Probably just going to say these two in fours to the whole perma ban yeah. and Anubis situation that they're going to run into again, but... It's definitely a good performance from Pain, but surely they're not going to be picking Inferno later on. I mean, I guess you never know. This They may just let it ride for the third map, though, for sure. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Definitely possible. As the rotations are in, and that's an answer from Che. So, knowing that he is over towards A, they threw a little bit of a fake over towards B. As NQZ has walked right up middle. There's only one defender here, really, and that's Nyx, but Zevi's close by, waiting for that rotation. He oh, he saw that him timing the is smoke. actually unreal. Yeah, but now, but now at least they know where he is, right? They know that he's going to be playing around that smoke as NQZ trying to entry it with his AWP, but not quite able to find it. Snow gets two. Okay, this is an interesting one now. One versus two. He knows they're going to be rotating in. He's a little bit worried about them trying to come through the smoke. They haven't yet, and he can't find the shot. A little bit too far to the right, actually, and it is going to allow Kawes to run straight through and find him. They know he's in the smoke. They finally put him down. Now Che, alone in the back of the site, has to be a hero. Kawes finds a second in CT, and Che's only good for one. It's a two on four. It's a retake on B, and this should be the end here for Fluxo on this first map, and Kawes just nails that one home one more time with another headshot onto Nyx. Can he find the fourth? No, he can't. Yeah, he's he's. there's so many things for him to clear out. It's just, uh, there's no hope. There is no hope as that tiny bit of hope that Art sort of put it back into his team with that round. If they can sneak up here, there is Zevi rotating over, but it's all going to come down to the timings. If they can just climb up. Oh, he hasn't I'll heard them. Here. He hasn't Zevi seen them. It. Yeah, no, 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 Zevi got caught. NQZ, oh, and now it's the timings. Oh, Che has to do something massive, can only get, can only get one. Luke Ozzy's inside of the hut. They know that he's there, though. And this should be a free bomb plant. But okay, that's a nice shot from Nyx. Now two on two. Each team knows exactly where the other people are as well. Oh, that's a Angle good advantage, shot. though. Bring QZ there to find the headshot. So now it's just one left. It's going to be Lukosi. He's slid out here by the Tetris piece. Good crossfire now established by Snow and company. They dance around the silos. Lukosi able to single out a 1v1. Has low HP on the second. Could he turn this thing around? But Snow playing so smart to burn the clock as much as he possibly can, oh! and he even finds the headshot in the end. You were very pleased if you got three rounds. Now Art in positions on top of the hut. They know that he's here, and it's the flank for Mini that actually punishes. But all of the CTs are here, but they're in heaven. Can they get out in time? Flash is good, gives them the space they need. And Nyx on the swing gets the double kill. Ooh, Zevi. Does get caught out of position, but unfortunately, NQZ is only able to land the tag as he peeks out, and that is a very bold dry peek from NQZ. As Big Uzera has crossed over towards red, and he's got a cross secret as well. The question is, did Zevi hear that last footstep? I'm not that sure he a... did, you know. I'm not sure he did. Uh, Art? That is Sir. so classic him. Sir. <laughs> Hard to, to recognize. They don't know, you're right. Yeah. Yeah, it's it's really hard to recognize where the sounds are coming from. Are they honestly. about to lose this round after the opening op pick they got and everything? It sure oh, looks no. like it. Positioning is good for Big Uzera. The smoke out towards the door. This is one of your few opportunities to actually pull a round out as Snow has just fully tucked himself away here. He's got the lineup on the bomb. He's seen the player. Oh, that's going to be a problem, though. He's taken down by the op. Cowes, he knows that the bomb's been tapped again, and he's looking for Che. Not able to find it, and it is finally going to be around. Low HP, and this should get cleared. It, whether you know, he knows they're running around above him, he manages to get one though, quickly traded. So it is the four on three, make that a four on two as Luca Ozzy comes through the smoke, grabs one more for himself, and they're gonna walk right through. This is so psycho, you have the man advantage. Why would you do that? Kawes gets a double at the very least as NQZ, he's gonna wrap all the way around, but does he have the time for this? That's the big question. What's, what does work in his favor is Zevi has not scaled up at all he checked and didn't see him and he gets past the fire oh, oh my goodness think he's he could not time that more perfect 
AK grabbed, and he's just sticking it. Pros, we know we've heard the stories. We know they don't fake. They do. Zevi gets off of it, and then QZ hits the shot. He oh, was no. so convinced. And sometimes that happens. Again, right there. Again, he pulls again, the smoke again, out. Of the nade out. But he does oh. get that kill. So, you know, salvage. Salvage and bomb down, by the way. So, you know, maybe it finally has tilted the opposite side for once. Snow and Lux, though, combining for a couple of kills to get this back into a three versus three and reclaiming that bomb near the hut position. Che, though, defending it still, not giving it to them for free. I can't even Kills believe how just... unlucky Zevi's been this round. Yeah, it's just been a wild ride. But they still have the bomb down and in their view, and they have low health now on big. It's going to be tough for Snow. 20 seconds. This is a... This is a really this is a really hard ask here he has the two flashes he's got to land these one taps he's gonna know that one's close he lands the headshot pushes in on art but they line up absolutely you'll take it however you can get it and right now zevi just got it really really badly by big uzera oh my as god Lux decides to give it imagine to just not as well. smoking and just running outside and getting two kills like that as a t team like that's bonkers what Ooh. response though from art yeah the swing out from hell you get in those windows, double kill. No one had their eyes on it. But he was able to find two pretty much for free. And he gets a third one on NQZ crossing outside. So Lux may have found a timing here towards hell, but we're not entirely sure. 1v2 now. And Nyx, he's creeping right up. So he knows he has him trapped here, essentially. He can't go anywhere. He can't leave. He can't move forward. As he tries to, it is going to be Nyx in the back line, getting that final frag. So a couple rounds right at the end of the half. To... One flash missed, but that's okay. A little unlucky as they run out, and they are popping straight down the vent. But Snow is able to get two of them with the dualies from on top of Hut. And now Luca Ozzy is lurking outside, running straight into the waiting arms of NQZ. As they go chasing down the vent, though, and Nyx gets two free kills. Bit of a mistake there for Pain Gaming, has to be said. Should know, no. never chase down the vent. That's a fair point. Shots ring out. Players in heaven, player in sight. Snow again is able to land the headshot. That's three on the round for him. Yeah, he just decided to take the chance and run down into B, but unfortunately for him, there is a man down here waiting and he has a gun. That's Kawes. Even though they're down secret with the bomb all the way outside, how is it how is it how are they gonna bring the bomb to him? And right now, Lux got Che brought right to him. Headshot towards Hut. And now the cross towards garage comes in and this is where nqz's tucked they ha he's tucked so far back they're not able to clear it in time and this is looking like a clean bonus round dust it is indeed nothing going against him until nix finally springs forward for a couple but he's still in a one versus three and he is not really even going to get a crack at it to a Quite spot literally. in that yeah to the blast ball showdown indeed they'll get on that plane and fly on over Ooh, big opening for nix though the hero ak we know that this team loves it Finds the opening pick. Lots of flashes into mini, but no one's in a position to capitalize on them. As Art with his CZ on T side once again. And player in the back of the site full blind. And it is Art opening it up with the CZ. And this is a round we wouldn't have expected them to win. And QZ not able to land the shot. Nade comes in and no shots able to land until now. They missed their smoke out towards heaven. I don't think it's going to make much of a difference. No. And QZ definitely just, just does not want to give them. Yeah, ships passing in the night. Neither really able to lob the shot forward. Lux, though, does find oh. Art. And now NQZ on the repeat sniffs out Zevi. And he's unable <laughs> to be punished as he steps out for another Lucozzi at red. And if there was any sort of hope from Fluxo after the previous round, it's been stamped out with this one. Moment. Yeah, 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 in the fog. But big spot. Fluxo didn't. That's really what it feels like as Snow manages to find a double headshot through the smoking door. And are they going to keep trying to go through this or are they going to go down the vent? What kind of impact that's going to have? Cal is already waiting down at the bottom as Lux quickly trades that one out. Nope, just that little bit of extra firepower. But now the smokes are going to be fading soon, so they need to get a move on. He spotted him through the smoke as Art tries oh, to walk Lord. through it. At least this time it was traded by Luca Ozzy and missed shot from NQZ means that he gets to stay alive. Yeah, I thought that was going to be traded right back, but yeah, a missed shot allows him to remain in the four on four. Kawes, though, going to find Nyx elsewhere on the map. Getting the man advantage back for pain on this map point situation and just keep. Well, Luca Ozzy, he wants to keep them alive here. Two on three. They don't have info on where Zevi is either. They only know that Luca Ozzy's somewhere outside. 
They go for the hut peak, which allows a couple of T's to slip through, but still it's good for one and that's enough. That'll do that, it. That is enough. That will do it. Pain take the map 13 to 6. They take the series 2 to 0. E aí, gostou dos melhores momentos de hoje? Não se esquece, as estatísticas estão aqui para você analisar. Pausa o vídeo caso você queira ver e acompanhar tudo certinho. Sua inscrição e seu like aqui embaixo é muito importante para a evolução do canal. Te vejo no próximo vídeo. Fui.